Hello and welcome to the Genomics Bootcamp. I am super happy to announce that the European Master in Animal Biodiversity and Genomics Master Program was funded by the European Union. This means that there are scholarships available for this program. In this video, I will talk briefly about the program, about the possibilities of, and about the study tracks and tell a bit more where you can find more information on this. This master program is called EMABG in short, and it is an international joint master program of six partner universities, of which the logos you can see on this uh, leaflet. And that is the Wageningen University, the University of Göttingen, SLU, Agroparitech, Boku University, and NMBU. So there are these six universities that come together to make this master program a reality. And because of the generous contribution from the European Union, we are able to give uh, scholarships to some students. And uh, well, this is also a video that announces the possibility of the of, of these scholarships and in fact, the call for scholarship applications that are open immediately. So what this means, so that if you want to come to study in EMABG, then you can apply for the scholarship. That means uh, a thousand four hundred euro per month scholarship from uh, from the European Union that goes directly to your account. Then that is for the travels, accommodation, and basically life during this uh, during the twenty four months of the of the studies. So these studies are for two years. And uh, so this 1,400 plus insurance and plus tuition fees are paid for you for the universities that you attend. So basically, if you get these scholarships, then you have no other worry than to study and to deal with the challenges of the master program. Of course, the possibility is also open for self-funded students or students funded from third party funding. That means uh, any governmental funds, any funding organizations that give scholarship outside of the EU and also, well, from employers, current employers or future employers or from any means. As I mentioned, the call for scholarship applications is open now and uh, because we were opening frankly late on this, so we have this this year a uh, extended deadline up until 28th of February 2025. But if you do not manage for any reason or you happen to be a bit earlier in your studies, well, because... Uh, well, to apply for this scholarship, for this master scholarship, you need to have at least a BSc finished. So if you happen to be in your BSc right now, you don't worry, because this scholarship or school for scholarship applications will return in 2026, 2027, and 2028. So there will be a number of other opportunities uh, where you can, we can, you can join us. Also, I wanted to tell you a few words about the master program itself. So I will return to the previous uh, slide uh, momentarily. So you will see that uh, information again, but actually everything is on the emabg.eu website in detail. But I thought, uh, well, I will describe the master program uh, briefly also here. So this is a two-year master program that leads to an MSc finish. So you, at the end, the successful students will receive an MSc degree. So when they start, as I mentioned, they need to have the BSc already finished. And uh, well, this is a two-year master program that starts at NNBU, uh, the Norwegian University of Life Sciences in, uh, well, in Norway. Uh, and everybody starts there. That is the, the first semester. And then afterwards, there are study tracks. So there, as you see, there is a uh, movement and that is a mandatory part of this program. So basically the student studies at two universities 
and also then receives two degrees so that this is a double degree program so you will have one master degree but two diplomas so the thing is, uh, so there are study programs and within the EMABG, so if you go down to route on Boku, that is in Austria, and that is the study program designing and implementing breeding programs for small populations. The University of Göttingen, so that is One Health, Health and Welfare in Humans and Animals. Uh, the Wageningen University uh, in the Netherlands offers uh, the study track conservation genomics for rare and endangered breeds and species. The AgroParitech and SLU study tracks is a bit, little bit shifted, but is the same two semesters in the second year of the studies. And in AgroParitech, the study track is the understanding biodiversity integrative biology. And at SLU, it is bioinformatics applied to biodiversity and genomics. So these are the study tracks. And in between, of course, there is a lot of international exchange uh, and uh, groups are by definition very international as well. There is a possibility of internships with our associated partners. There are joint events at the welcome event at NMBU. There is a summer course in Austria in Vienna, and then also a joint graduation ceremony. So, uh, well, there is a lot more information on the EMABG website, including the curriculum, the courses, and everything you might want to know. Also, I would like to use this opportunity to directly address the students from the European Union. Folks, where are you? We all the time receive a super low number of applications from students from the European Union. Well, because of the how the, the system is set up and uh, because of the funding rules of the EU, there are specific quotas for students from the European Union. Yet, we receive every time a much lower number of applications from the students from the European Union as we anticipate. Uh, yet, you also receive 1,400 per month and the same benefits. So, uh, I, I, I honestly, I don't know why is this happening. It keeps happening all the time. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I just wanted to ask you, where are you at? So, well, this is... Uh, just a, a specific reminder that you too can apply and you can come for this uh, for this master program and uh, yeah we'd love to have you but for this you need to apply so I, I know it might be more convenient to to study at your home country but perhaps uh, put up some adventure boots and uh, yeah just see what's uh, what's in the neighborhood. So I just really warmly encourage you to apply. Okay, so basically uh, this was uh, more or less it, what I, what I wanted to let you know. There is one technical thing that uh, comes up all the time and that is the question of the English tests. So in the website, you will see uh, a, a specific section on this. Well, unfortunately, because of the rules of the degree awarding institutions, we need to request a specific English tests also from students who might have had their ed previous education done in English. This does not apply for everybody. There are some specific countries that for whatever reason are on a list that uh, do not need to provide uh, these specific English tests, but uh, all the others who are not on this list need to provide these tests. Uh, well, unfortunately, we cannot do anything regarding to this. So these, uh, these are the rules that also we have to comply with. So just uh, when you apply, just also please take note of the, the English requirements. Other than that, I just invite you again to check out the website and definitely do not miss out 
on this opportunity of a lifetime. From my side, this is everything for now. I, uh, well, thank you for your time and I wish you a really nice day.